Yo, what's up, everybody, and welcome to not an online game of Man 12. On Man 12, this is an offline game. This is um, someone asked me to do the franchise, and I wasn't gonna do it because I'm actually I, I said I was done with my franchise mode, but I decided, you know what? I'll I'll just do the Super Bowl, especially since I haven't played it much. I know I know I said um that I was gonna start playing Man 12 online, but the one thing that happened that made me stop it, I decided to buy 2K12. So yeah. I was playing that for the past few days instead of Madden, but I, I just, um, I played this last night, and, um, yeah, you can see my team here. I'm gonna go through the, um, roster, and I'm, I'm going through, like, my whole depth chart and tell you guys about it. First of all, this is my quarterback, my franchise quarterback. He's rated at 88. He's only in his, uh, first year or whatever. He's gonna, he's gonna be special, man. He's gonna be special. That's what they say, right? Um, Ryan, Roy Hulu, or Ryan Hulu, however you say it, he's my running back. He's, he led the league in rushing his first year, but he's been suffering injuries since. He got injured for like almost the whole regular um season this year. And you see Tory Smith. Um I trade I did a big trade. I'll talk about that later. And um yeah, the rest of those guys are just like guys I drafted. Um Hankerson is actually somebody the Redskins had and I just kept him and he ended up being alright. And the guy Jackson, he was um he he was my return guy, but he got um he got put on um IR and and also my um second string running back Moore, he got put on IR. You see I have Nick Fairley there. Two other um defensive tackles I drafted. Um, I have Brooks Reed. Um, yeah, Fairley and Reed I um traded for both of them too. Um, there's um my middle linebacker. He's on the, both all those middle linebackers I drafted. Arakpo obviously was with the um Redskins, and then um Larry English, the veteran, signed him off of like free agency or not free agency, just like off of um whatever it is midseason. Then you see um my corners. I have Jimmy Smith. That was from the Tory Smith trade, and then um. Josh Wilson, who was with the Redskins, as well as um my um safeties, both of them, Atogway, or whatever his last name is, and um Landry, they're both already from the Redskins, and then um you can see the Patriot thing, but yeah um the other corners I drafted, and yeah my tight ends I didn't touch on them um that one guy Campbell he is like a huge part of my offense um my franchise because you'll see you'll see how he plays he he's like I I I like to call him my bowling ball because. He catches stuff and he's like so round and stuff. He just bounces off people, and does all that stuff. He he's usually get he usually gets the bulk of catches though. He's also a little bit injury prone, so I live with that. And um, by the way, Josh Wilson, he he's not an IR for this game, but he was injured during the playoffs. I didn't put him IR, but he's not gonna be available for me for the Super Bowl, which is not good because he was really good during the regular season. I think he had a lot. He had like ten picks during the regular season. He was really good. But without further ado, here is my Super Bowl. And on the first play, you see like Plaxico Burris. I didn't say this, but Plaxico, Plaxico Burris, who um got the game winning touchdown against the Patriots in 2008, I believe. He comes back to try to help the Patriots, gets a catch there early, and they they had a little bit of momentum though. I kind of crushed it with that one sack. Then on third down, he tried to get it to Banks. I I, I think that might be Brandon Banks. I like go for him because he kept on getting injured. I didn't feel like having him. And plus, I had that Jackson guy who was 99 speed. I was like, okay, that's my return guy. I don't need Brandon Banks. Well, yeah, here that that's my man, um, Terrence Campbell, making a catch. I tried to get to him again. He was wide open, but I ended up getting hit. That happened a few times in this game. That's usually just a product of playing on all Madden or whatever. You see Hankerson. That's his only catch. I don't really throw it to my. I usually throw it to my um. Two tight ends and Tory Smith and sometimes Hill. I usually don't make much use of my um third receiver. Then um here you see it in second and one. Some nice moves by um Roy Roy, Roy I don't know what the hell his first name is. We're just gonna call him Hulu. Hulu makes a couple of swift moves and gets into the end zone for a touchdown. It's about like 50 yards. I go up early. Huge momentum. Everybody's celebrating. Let's see if I can hold it up and um. By the way, the my road to the Super Bowl, I almost did not even make it past the divisional round because um the Giants, I almost lost to the Giants. It was like I I, I was only getting field goals in that game. It was like twelve to ten, and then um, Eli Manning threw a big bomb. Oh, you see, Tory Smith gets hurt there, and that actually kind of hurt me because he did he did come back, but he was injured. He was his speed was down, so I couldn't really. You see, he has bruised ribs. Like, I don't know why. For some reason, the speed was down for some of the games, so I couldn't really, I didn't really do much deep throws to him, so. 
I, I worked around it though. It wasn't really a huge deal. It's not like I, I'm like it's not like I do a lot of deep throws anyway. I just do some, but um, but I did do a lot of my um like my conference championship game was against the Panthers, and I completely booed them out because they kept on trying to blitz me. So uh, especially on third down, so I would get like all my touchdowns were at least 40 yards or longer because they just kept on blitzing and leaving wide open spots. So I just took advantage of that, and plus like. Roy Hulu had a huge day running. And then here we go, third and 20. That's Campbell making the catch there. A lot of injuries happened in this game. A lot of Patriots went down. A lot of um, Vultures went down. I got to explain that. That's my that's my franchise's name. I, I decided not to be the Washington Redskins. I decided to relocate to New York City into Manhattan. Third down conversion ever. Yeah. And then I'm like, I, I, like I, I think I said it earlier, like in an earlier video, but I like to call my team the Vultures. I don't know why. It's just me. And um, you see a pick here. It's kind of like Chase Blackburn's pick, kind of, because he just like throws it deep to so nobody who's open. And then that guy Jenkins, he, I, I didn't mention this, but I have like seven cornerbacks in my depth chart because I, I only run this one defense because I don't know. I, I don't, it works. So I don't really care to run their defense and offline. It's like, I'm not really that into it. I'm just going to keep on doing that. Hey, look at this guy, this Campbell guy. See, he's bouncing around there. That, that, that's what he does. And then, um, Hulu bursting through there on third and inches. I already have a 13, nothing lead looking to expand it. This guy, Hill, he's my number two receiver. He's like, I think it's in his um second year, but he, he was he did not have a good Super Bowl. Whenever I I try to throw them like three times, I think he dropped it twice. And then here in Laurent Landry, he has been injury prone for me a lot. He gets injured like every other game. This time he goes out for the game, so you will not see Laurent Landry for the Super Bowl. Instead, you get to see um Deshaun Gomes, whatever I, I think that's name is Deshaun, but yeah, he he actually ended up being all right. He was on the Redskins roster before. He's rated at 85, so he's good. But he's in the last year of his contract, so I'll probably let him go. But then here you see um. Last seconds before the first half, and um, yeah, I try, I try to get something done, but I just couldn't. So I just took a field goal, and there's no halftime show because I'm just gonna, just I'm just talking about other stuff anyways. I mean, but yeah, um, you see right here, this um, this is like a hit, one two hit on them, get a big return, and then next play, Roy Ra, 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 Hulu gets a touchdown, and um, you notice there, I did not have an actual third um tight end in that big set. Instead, I had um, a, a lineman, and I, I saw some people do it online. Like, put um, their third tight end as a lineman. Because, like, do you really throw to your third, third, third tight end? I don't. So, I, I, I decided to try it out in my fandom mode, and it actually worked pretty good. So, that might be something I go back to online, just switching out that um, third tight end for a lineman, do that bunch formation. I like to call it, like, the bunch of crunch formation. That's just, I don't know why. I just like something in my head. Because, like, I used to like bunch of crunch candy when I was a kid. So, I was like, oh, like the bunch of crunch formation. But, yeah. And then, um, here's a huge stop on third down. Plaxico Burr is trying to fight. Plaxico Burr was the main target for some reason. Uh, that's supposed to be Wes Welker, but for some reason, Tom Brady said, no, I'm throwing to Plaxico Burr 10 times in this game. And then, you see, I just did a completely bonehead move. And... It cost me, and I almost lost a fumble. I think this guy fumbled twice, my quarterback, but nothing got lost. So that was good, especially since that was so deep. And then here, I kind of screw up. I I had I had a chance to hit um, Welker and force a fumble because he did not call for a fair catch, but I got there too fast, unfortunately, and I get a penalty. He actually got a good return anyway, so it only put five extra yards on. But my defense holds up here. Actually, no, they don't. They give up. I, I'm not really sure this is Brandon Banks. I kind of doubt it is. But the Patriots did not have good receivers outside of Pisco Burris. So it was just Welker and Burris that were actually good. And you see here, that's one of my cornerbacks. All my cornerbacks are like pretty good. They're going to be good in the in future years if I ever play this again. And, um, you see, Pisco Burris gets stopped one yard short. Can't do anything about it. So they get the field goal. Get the ball back to me. And I'm just like, eh, let me, let me do short throws. I don't really care. This guy, Justice, I signed him because I had, um, Jackson was injured. And then, um, Hankerson also got injured midseason, so I had to replace him. And then here, Campbell gets open. And then, um, I thought he was injured, Campbell. So I, I was like, whoa. It was actually the Patriot guy. But Campbell does get injured later in the game. But he, like, comes back right away. But, yeah, um, here I get, see another one hit. That's my lineman. He comes back. And I didn't talk about my offensive lineman at all. Um, I, I worked hard this year in trying to draft him. I didn't draft any, like, the previous year, really. I, of course, you have um, Trent Williams. But besides that, I don't really have anybody. I ended up hitting big on um, a right guard, like something Martin, who was rated, like, an 84 out of the draft, which is really good. So... Yeah, and then um, Hulu putting his um stamp on the MVP trophy. 
gets his third touchdown. But um, my cornerback James, I think it's like Sean James, he decides that he wants the MVP trophy. And since this game is in love with people who return picks for touchdowns, always giving those people the MVP. That guy ended up winning the MVP. I'll just spoil that. Like I was like, what the hell? Like Blue had like over 150 yards and three touchdowns, but this guy gets the MVP because he gets a interception return for a touchdown in a game that was already over practically. I I didn't understand, but um yeah. Um I'm just gonna like I'm gonna talk quick about the 2K my 2K experience because one thing I want I wanted to know you guys like what you got, how you guys have experienced playing offline is first of all I. I can really suck online. I, I got I got him blown out twice. I taken the Knicks and um kind of went to play with Jeremy Lin and then um I played against the Clippers and like Chris Paul just kept on hitting threes in both games. I guess I wasn't playing good. Like they would always like hurry up and I'm like I, I'm thinking I'm playing good on ball defense, but they just like throw up three pointers and just jacking up. Karan Butler had a game where he was like nine for nine from the three point range. That's not even my guy. I do play play point guard, but um yeah. An offline, one problem I have is that I'm playing good defense for the first 23 seconds of the shot clock, but then in the 24th second, the computer manages to put up this bullshit shot and get the points, and that, that like, frustrates me because, like, I'm playing good defense. Like, they just, they just like, throw up shots, like, randomly, and yet they still get it. I know just, like, be behind the three-point line, just chuck one up at the, um, right for the buzzer and get it, but it's, uh, but uh, yeah, here we go. I I could have just like kneeled the ball, but I, I wanted to get a throwing touchdown. I didn't want to. I if you didn't notice, I only had um field goals and running touchdowns. So I wanted to get a throwing touchdown. Threw it to my man Campbell, who uh, yeah, like you saw, he got injured and um came back. But yeah, this is the closing seconds here. Um, not much else to say other than Tom Brady did not play good at all in the Super Bowl. He looked like he was gonna do good early. He hit the corner throw, hit another throw again. But after that, had him out of his rhythm, and that, that's one. Re that's the reason why I'm not really gonna play this franchise offline anymore. Any offline, because like the de like I built this defense so good that people just don't score on it. Like Tom Brady's not scoring on my defense. I'm like, I don't, I don't know what to do about it. I don't know like what ratings to fix or any of that, and I don't really care that much. I can live without it. So yeah, that's just that. And then you see the Redskins logo here. I don't know what the why the Redskins logo is there. I guess they already built it in. I would love to see my Vultures logo, but whatever. And then up here, you see, this is the last goal. Um, a little thing. He's trying to get a, uh, a cheap touchdown. I was trying really, really hard to make sure he didn't get it. And now it goes to fourth down. 11 seconds left. I sent a blitz at him. He almost gets that, but that guy Jenkins tipped it. And then that was the game, and I won the Super Bowl. Whoa. It's not like, that was not an exciting game, obviously. I just put this up to put this up because I need, I need to put something up really quick, right? And plus, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys my franchise, what I did. It's in its third season. Just completed the third season really now that this thing is done. And um, what I usually do is, like, I usually get my fran I usually build my franchise through the draft. I know some people, like, they like to do it through free agency and they don't really care about drafting. They'll, like, trade away their draft picks. But for me, I, I like building it through the draft. I trade away, like, like the trade I did with, um, with the Ravens, I traded away um, Santana Moss and D'Angelo Hall for Jimmy Smith and Tory Wilson. Tory Wilson, wow. <laughs> um, Tory Smith, and then um, yeah, the um, but with the um, Fairley and Brooks Reed trades, those guys are on the trade block, so I immediately jump and I'm like, why are these guys on the trade block? I will take it. <laughs> so yeah. Yeah, that's what I usually do to do the thing. I usually don't like do those trades like I did with the Ravens, but I, I don't do much trades at all. If anything, I trade players for draft picks. That's what I do. But um, yeah, that's the game. I'll see you guys later for online game next time. So yeah, see you guys later.